just pull up. Uh, before I get started on this back and bicep exercise, I thought I'd jump in here real quick and give me some uh, tanning on my legs. My legs, uh, like a lot of people, have a little bit of uh, resistance to getting some color, so I had to tan my. I'm trying to tan my legs and get them to catch up with the rest of my body as far as getting some color on them. But the way this bed is positioned, I can get in there and lay just my legs in it and kind of hang out this other side and everything's all good. So, But anyway, we're going to blast some back and biceps today. I hope you guys enjoy what we got coming. And I'll see y'all here, here over in the gym here in just a second. Later. workout let me know in the comments what y'all thought about that anyway uh, I was gonna drop in and just give you guys a little heads up on some goals and stuff you know I've talked before about the importance of setting goals and uh, you know along with my fat loss and everything like that I'm still I still have strength goals so I've decided to set I guess a, at least a long-term strength goal of this time this year so by this time next year I want to be able to pull a one rep max on deadlift of 500 pounds now the last time I one rep, I, I did pull the one rep max on deadlift, I pulled 445. Now I'm sure my strength has fallen off a little bit um, since I stopped, you know, the strength specific training. So uh, I'll have to at some time assess where I'm at, and that way I can start setting like some short term goals that will lead me to the big, you know, 500 pound goal for next year. Uh, and I'm figuring that my strength dropped off there because I did notice the other day um, I did squats and. You know, by the time you see this, you may have, may or may not have already seen my fail, my fail on it because I did, I did film it when I failed. But I got in the, underneath 315, which pr my previous one rep max on the squats was 345, and I got under 315 and I couldn't come back up with it. Now, of course, that was like six sets in, so I might have just been exhausted. But I know that I was not coming up with that 315, and just I, I didn't feel it. So I'm thinking my strength has tapered off quite a bit. You know, at least at least 10 percent so uh you know i'll assess sometime here in the next couple of weeks i'll do a i'll do a one rep one rep max day and assess where i'm at on those strength days strength goals so i can say all right one year from that day and then i'm going to start setting maybe like every six or eight weeks uh, strength goals that i want to meet leading uh, leading up to that 500 pounds so uh guys let me know what you think about that um i think 
other than that, I don't have much of anything else to add right now. Uh, I'm just exhausted. I'm fixing them there, make me a protein shake. I'm giving my creatine and stuff time to, to settle in. And uh, I'm, just, I'm, I'm just exhausted. Tomorrow is a leg day. Legs and shoulders tomorrow. So that ought to be fun. Y'all stay tuned for that one. But anyway, I'm going to go uh, get some clean clothes on, get some, uh, get some protein down in me. Watch some TV. I don't know. I might mess around with one of my guitars here. Uh, but then again, I probably will. I'll probably, I'll probably uh, go sit down in front of the TV, grab my laptop, and start start editing some videos. But anyway, guys, um, y'all just stay tuned for some more content. And don't forget to check out uh, Alpha Pump Athletics. You know, I'll keep plugging them, but you know, I'm, I'm glad to be I'm glad to be a part of the Alpha Pump Athletics team. So y'all get check them out. The links and stuff down down in the description below. And go out there, have a good time, get yourself some good good gains, and good night.